Hi everybody, and welcome to Open Source Tonight. Today I want to talk about Ubuntu 22.04, the brand new long-term support release released by Canonical a few days ago. So, today I want to talk about three features. One, you can see, if you take a look at these screenshots, the brand new curves that you see in the current version of the GNOME desktop. Personally, I'm not a big fan of making this stuff like so curved. Maybe a light curve would be okay, but like not like a super curve, you know, like to me, this is too curvy, but to each their own, some people like it. So there's that. Two, snaps seem to be a little more included in the system this time around, which I'm not surprised by. Ubuntu's parent company Canonical has been for a long time kind of going towards this, um, you know, snap packaging future. So, but there is still app stuff in there. And number three, from what I can tell, the stability, right? Like this is just another long-term support release. And the goal is really to give the consumer a reliable operating system, right? So it seems like a pretty nice thing we also have a couple other cool things in it, like Live Patch, of course, uh, is in there. Um, you know, there's different little things like that. So I personally think, at least for me, that I'm not going to be moving to 2204 presently. But at some point down the road, I probably will. I've still got stuff on 2004 and 1804. Uh, mostly 2004, but there's a little bit of 1804 left. And so I personally do not see the need to move to this immediately. I think if you're using 1804, or 1604 and you're happy, I just stay there, right? But if you feel like that you do want to go ahead and move and be kind of on the cutting edge, I would at least advise you to wait a few weeks while that they are not any last minute bugs that could be in the LTS. In my experience in the past, operating system releases in general, but Ubuntu is no exception. Uh, you know, when they first release that new quote stable release, there could still be a few bugs they've missed in there. And often there is, which again, you know, as a software developer, I can relate to that. Like, you know, you're going to have bugs, but again, you know, you, you want to wait at least a little bit. So that way, hopefully they fix most of those. If you're going to be using it in a mission critical environment, or if you just want it to work reliably. So, and uh, you know, that's something I want. So I can, you know, relate to that. Anyway, I hope you found the video useful. This is just a quick video. Eventually, I'll probably do like a full rundown of Ubuntu 2204 on the channel. But until then, thanks for watching Open Source Tonight. Goodbye, everybody. And action.